I am an athlete. And when I first picked up the Shanxi Temple hat and became world champion, a new journey began. Yeah, so many people here. It's uh, crazy to be back when I first came here in protection. Back here in Taiwan, back in Changhua, and uh, back with a hat, and now I even got my name on it. So, yeah, it kind of feels like picking up the hat again. It's uh, the story continues, and uh, at first I didn't know what kind of like this hat means, both uh, literally and figuratively. It's uh, it's been a crazy story. This time I also had more time to explore uh, more of Taiwan and be eating more Taiwanese food and I've been enjoying it more. Welcome to Taiwan! I had to come to this special place and uh, the first time I came here like the 20 hour flight from Norway I was so excited I <laughs> yeah it's hard to, to sleep even though you're really tired so when I landed here and just saw all the amazing people and amazing culture it was uh, yeah well, I felt I really felt the love yeah I truly believe that I have a special connection with Taiwan Score. I'm now the tourist ambassador for uh, Taiwan and Changhua County. So, uh, yeah, I've always been uh, really positive about Taiwan and I wanted people to come here, but now it's more an official role. And the more I've been in Taiwan, the more I realize that uh, all the people have to come to Taiwan and especially Norwegian. Yeah, exp experience different cultures is extremely important. So that's why I want to bring Taiwan to Norway. So my life motto is uh, winning is a choice. I guess everyone puts a different meaning to it, but for me it's uh, taking the choices in the day-to-day -day life to, uh, to put you where you want to be. And for me, I always had a long dream of uh, winning the Olympics and become world champion and just be a better person. So in my day-to-day -day life, I always try, what do I do now to reach my goals? Is it uh, sit on my phone late at night or is it go to bed? Is it to like put in the extra hours of training or is it to skip out? So uh, yeah, for me it's always taking an active choice in your life to, to put you where you want to be. And people give a lot of credit to this lucky hat. And in one sense it is a lucky hat because uh, I have done a lot of winning in it. But it also, it also gave me a huge adventure coming here to Taiwan become an honorary citizen here and uh, just become kind of like a symbol of hope and unity in Taiwan. So I don't think this hat really brings out like magical powers, but it brings out what you have within you. It kind of gives you uh, yeah, a sense of hope and uh, it's, it's really is lucky in that sense because for me it really changed my life 